All right, good afternoon, everybody. Here's what you need to know. Isolated showers are going to be possible over the next couple of hours. Lower humidity. How about that is arriving tonight and we'll talk about what to watch out for the upcoming weekend. I can already tell you now rain and storms. There are a few dots on here right now. Not many, and I do think these will be going away as the evening goes along. So the drier air is going to come in, went out and basically take away rain chances until Friday afternoon. Notice not near as many uh, dots on the radar as there was yesterday. If you missed out, some people were going through flooding situations just 24 hours ago, so it's becoming a lot calmer. 88, the number right now out at Memphis International Airport. That number is going to be falling. It really is going to end up being a pleasant night, so if you get a chance to get outside, nice breeze out of the northeast. Look at Covington, 22 miles per hour. That is pushing the humidity away, and actually it's not just going to do that for to this evening. It's going to go all the way into tomorrow as well. Heat index will be lower than the temperature. Friday we start to inch up again and then the weekend uh, becomes humid on Saturday. We'll have rain chances Saturday before more nice weather returns next week. So you need the umbrella Friday, Saturday and Sunday. All of those days present rain chances, although I will tell you Saturday to me looks like the highest chance for rain. So the clouds go away tonight. Skies become mostly clear. Hey, a nice way to start our day on Thursday, 88 at 2 o'clock in the afternoon, but with low humidity, it's going to be very tolerable. And even tomorrow night is going to be nice as well. So enjoy these 60s, maybe even some upper 50s. Now here's when the changes come in again. This is Friday at noon. Notice rain working perhaps into the eastern counties of our coverage area. Corinth, Tippa, Benton, Hardeman, McNary, those areas. Friday night could be some showers as well, mainly in our southern counties. And as we head into Saturday, this is when the higher chances for rain come late in the morning and into the afternoon. Southern Heritage Classic, it seems like the last five years we have dealt with weather and it looks like that's going to happen again this year. 73, this is your Thursday planner at 9 o'clock, 82 at lunchtime at 84 at 3 with low humidity. Not a bad Thursday at all. Seven day forecast shows we do hit 90 again on Friday. Humidity starts to rise to rain chances Saturday, Saturday night and Sunday morning. Uh, but the good news is that's going to be a nice front. I mean, look at next week, low 80s, low 60s at night. Some people will be in the 50s. It is really going to be nice. Get our app to stay ahead of the storms when we're not on the air. We're online all the time. Easy to download and free ABC 24 back in a flash after this short break.